dig on uh, typically Easter Sunday and I think I've got a heraldic shield pendant looks like a nice one anybody got any squirty oh look at the enamel showing through <laughs> whoops concentrate that's my banana let's get a bit of squirty on it looks like it's gone oh. it's quite caked you can see some red enamel can't see much else huh? Oh, it looks like a, a shield with a emblem down through the middle with a load of dots oh it's coming through now it's got lions on it hey <laughs> it's got a lion on it that side and it looks like some other bits and pieces nice heraldic shield excellent Well, on the dig on the 1st of April, and there's a sovereign penny of either Henry VIII or Henry VII. Just nicked out the top of his head. And that's my April hammered. Done, still on target. Excellent. Sovereign penny type. Superb. out on a dig with some mates in Dorset and this has just come up and um, we're debating whether it's part of a steel yard weight it's definitely heraldic it's got some um, shields on every corner and it's got like a castellated edge and it's absolutely stunning nice well just turned this one over thought it was a cartridge that looks suspiciously like a a disc brooch or the back of a disc brooch you can see the pin marks we haven't that's just on his way down hopefully it'll have some enamel something on it oh it's a it's a star shaped one don't know that there's any enamel left but it's a very nice disc Roman brooch. It's got like a, a sunburst. Pattern on it, but no enamel left unfortunately. Very nice. Well, not the prettiest of artifacts, but it is an early Celtic Latin brooch. BT, 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 BC, somewhere along the line. Um, it's not the prettiest of brooches I've ever found, but it is a Celtic um, Latin brooch. Well, it's that time of year when we can get out after work and I've just had a signal got any water there's some squirty yeah, yeah. um I'll stand up oh literally first hang on let me get it in focus okay literally first go on you have to pump it literally first signal and I think um, I've squirt it onto the Yeah, it's a silver denari, looks like a lady. Oh, Dad's getting the big water out, messing about, he said, with a squirt. Go on, keep going. Look at that. 
Beautiful. So first signal. We literally just been on the we haven't even been on the field less than a minute. I would say it was Julia Domana, but I'm terrible at uh, Roman Silvers. Or well, Roman on the field IDs, but that'll do. I think we'll go back to the car and go home. <laughs> Brilliant. Dad shaking his head in disbelief, but that's a that's one way to start. Superb. Nice uh, rural artifact. It's a it's a palm guard that would have sat in your palm like that for sewing up trousers. I don't know speed bags, whatever. But it's actually shaped so it fits in the palm of your hand and it actually indents where your fingers are. And it's got a dimple in the middle, push the needle through. which would have uh, pushed your needle through to that point. So post medieval. Nice bit of rural history. Fantastic. Well, Sunday with Dad. I think we've got a bit of Celtic silver. Go on, Dad. Have a go. See what we've got. Oh, yep. All over me. Go on. Keep, keep, keep going. Whoop, whoop, yeah. whoop. Oh, look at that. Moon face. Moon face to the right. Hopefully we've got a pony. Can you yeah. see? Can you see? Yep, there's the horse. Galloping right, I think. Whoa, yep. Look out. Got a bit, a bit more. Trying to... See which way it goes. There somewhere. There's a horse there somewhere we think. And another moon face. That's so I thought it was a skeet. I'll take Celtic. <laughs> Every day of the week. Nice one. Well, didn't film this live, it sounded very much like a cartridge, but it is in fact some sort of crucifix. Rather nice. Bronze. Got some age to it, I would think. That's really rather special. Quite like that. Excellent. That's a nice 70. We're after a hammy, so it's hammy numbers, but probably going to be a cartridge. Sounds quite nice. So let's have a look. Still, still in the hole. There we go. I have a feeling this could be Roman silver. 
I'm going to get my glasses on. I've got a feeling this is a denari. And on the other hand, it might not be. No, it's just a copper. Just a copper Roman. Nice, but I thought for a second then it was a denari. Sunday morning, or I'm out Sunday morning. Um, you can see, just under the surface, I hopefully, what I've got, I think, might be a bit special. Come on, you can find out with me. I'm hoping it's going to be a silver denari. There you go. Roman silver denarius. Who's on the back? Oh, Scepter Servius, perhaps? I'll take Roman Denari all day long, thank you very much. Superb. Look at that. Beauty. Oh, made up with that. Well, it's been a while since we've had any of this stuff. It looks silverish to me. I think it's going to be particularly old. And it's a. Uh, I've lost it again now. Where'd it go? Oh. <laughs> There we go, not particularly old, but very welcome, 1935 six months. Are you two years old, are you six years old? Uh, a bit George, of v, George V, shiny six months. Wow, this little beauty's just turned up. Well, it's a little hammered. It is beginning to look like it's a Saxon hammered. It's what crossed on there. It's Saxon coin. It is, look. It's got the little V's in the corner, look. It's avoided Saxon coin. Oh, has it got a nasty crack right across there? I think it has. <gasps> Who's it going to be? Don't fall apart on me. Don't fall apart on me. Water. <gasps> oh, look at that, look. <gasps> there you go. Look at the head. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Look at the head on that, Dad. Yeah, I can see it. I can see it. <laughs> They're good. Saxon Penny. Oh, my God. Saxon penny out of the pastures. That is just unbelievable. Want a bit of water on it? Go on, just to give it a dab, see if we can get a better shot. I have no idea who that is, mate, have you? Ethel Red, I think. Ethel Red? <laughs> just chuck that out there, have you? Get in there. Look at that. Just a Good evening YouTubers, it's that time of the month, I'm just getting ready to upload and I just thought I'd do a quick round up, um, quiet month for fines, so although I probably had the three of the rarest coins I've ever had, um, this is a Wombra wheel, Celtic, uh, been confirmed, um, 
excessively rare. There's only only been eight ever recorded. This is a Pertinax denaris, denarii, and he was only emperor for three months, so it's probably the rarest Roman I'm ever going to find. Thanks to Phil, Phil Tap for brilliant ID, because I my field ID was set to service, so pretty pretty rubbish. But Phil put me right. Thanks, Phil. And then the last one, but not least, was this Edward the Confessor silver penny pyramid types. Um, yep, yeah, generally not a very rare coin, but. I sent it off to the Fitzwilliam Museum. They've recorded it. And it is the only Winchester Mint they've recorded. Doesn't necessarily mean it's the only one. But it's the only one that's ever been recorded as a Winchester Mint. Which is brilliant news. So, not massive amount of fines this month. But quality over quantity. Um, quite amazing. Um, glad you hope you enjoy the live digs more or less. Did some live digs because somebody said, can you do some live digs? So I've done them. Um, curse the live dig most of the time. But uh, we had a few finds that, that popped up whilst doing live digs. So I've, I'll include those. But like I said, a bit scarce on the finds this month. But these are possibly the three rarest coins I've ever found. Unbelievable. Well, happy hunting. Um, good luck to everybody. I'll see you in a field somewhere. Cheers. Bye.